Hey guys, welcome back to a new video. Look what I got today. I got a turkey leg. Huge. Huge. Look. Turkey leg. It looked like it smoked, but I cooked it in the oven. I already been eating off of it. And it's delicious. Y'all, that thing good. Look how I've been picking off of it. That joker know it big right there. It's good. All right, y'all. So if you are new to this channel, go ahead and hit that subscribe button down below. Um, also, give this video a thumbs up if you like it. If not, I am so sorry about that. Share this video with anyone and everyone you know. And I ain't going to take that long to get into it today, y'all, because I ain't been asleep since I got off. I got to tell y'all what happened to me today. And don't be looking at my face, so yeah, I don't have no makeup, but that's just because I'm tired. I ain't got no black eyes or anything. My skin just do that when I'm real tired to do that. Anyway, I'm going to say my grace right quick so I can start eating while I'm talking to y'all. Amen. Okay, so school started back today, y'all. Day Monday. Hopefully, I'm going to post this video today, too. Um, so I had to go to the school finished the registration class for some reason i wasn't able to complete it online it wouldn't let me i kept running into all kind of problems i was like bump it i'll just do it at school when i get a chance so i went up there to the school i'm just getting back and and a tender mm. went up to the school did all the paperwork and everything you know Got to the end, getting ready to get the Chromebook. So the lady, you know, um, real sweet lady at school. But she was like, oh, you didn't sign this one. I said, I know. I left it blank on purpose. She said, well, she's not going to be able to get the Chromebook if you don't sign it. I said, well, give me the paperwork. She told me, okay, so she did go try to find out about paperwork. So they told her it ain't no paperwork. I either got to sign it or my daughter ain't going to get a Chromebook. And I had to call the district, you know, the um, Muskogee County School District. So, if you know me, anybody who know me, they know, if I don't believe in it, I'm not going to put my name on it. I ain't going to sign it. I, I just ain't going to do it. So, I called the school district, but I'm going to tell y'all this. Um, the guy that I was supposed to be talking to, today is first day of school. He's not in the office. I left a voicemail for him to get back in contact with me. I also have his email. I haven't sent the email yet, but I'm going to do it when I get through email before I lay down and go to sleep. So my thing is, everybody virtual. You're going to slide this paperwork in here and say, I got to sign this before my child get the laptop. And even though everything is virtual and she got to have the laptop in order to complete her schooling, if she break it, something happened to it, I'm responsible for it. I ain't got $400. So I ain't signing it. So I'm just waiting now till somebody call me back. They probably ain't going to call me back today, maybe tomorrow. But in one day, she's going to be the miss already today. I'm going to wait and see what we're going to do. Because she got to get an education now. But how's she going to do it? And then here's the thing, y'all. Here's the kicker that get me. Like I said, I ain't talked to nobody at school district. So I don't know what they're going to have to say or, you know, what else they're going to do to um, for her to get her school work done and stuff. So I got to wait on that. But I'm just speaking on Muskogee County School District. So, they'll give you a form to fill out. And, like, if your child got to go on a field trip, they send the form home. You have to sign your name, date it, send it back. And on this form, they say, okay, your child going on a field trip, blah, 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 McDonald's, whatever, you know. But sign your name here because we ain't going to be responsible for your child. While they on this school bus, while they going to the McDonald's, while they up under this bus driver, whether he may be intoxicated or whatever, we're not going to be responsible for your children. So we need you to put your name right here on the dotted line and date it. The devil is a lie. 
Mine ain't going on a field trip then. Because I ain't starting it. I ain't gonna do it. If I don't believe in it, I ain't gonna put my name on it. And that's what you ain't gonna make me do. But like I say, I gotta wait and see, you know, what all they gonna help me do with getting her in school without me signing that paper, getting that laptop. Now, if they just wanna leave it to me, let me use it, because I'm gonna return it. But my child's so clumsy, this is the thing. She done broke her iPhone. She done tore up every tablet she done ever had. She, uh-uh, she too clumsy. It'll be just my luck. She get these both things and drop it and break it. And then, what, $400 looking at me. Not at me, it ain't. Because I ain't got it. Well, I got me a great Arizona drink, y'all. So that's what my morning been like. I ain't even got my grandbaby today. He gone with his daddy. Because I've been at school since I got out of work. Mm. I had started cooking the turkey leg yesterday, but it wasn't finished before I left. So I took it out, put it in the refrigerator, and I finished it in the oven this morning. It's so tender and good. But I don't know if y'all know, if y'all cook turkey, if you cook turkey, and if you overcook it, it'd be real chewy. Like, it won't be good. This is just right. It's so good. And it's even better on the grill. Yep. No grill today. I ain't gonna be able to eat this whole big old turkey leg. Turkey leg. Probably too big. I'm gonna put some hot sauce on it. This is my favorite hot sauce bowl. And y'all know what? I got something else to say about this COVID mess. It's stuck on COVID. I'm telling you. It just a messed up everything. And um this it's my personal opinion, okay? Don't be telling me. She shouldn't have said this, so she don't know she's talking about it. It's my personal opinion. These are not facts that I'm about to say. My personal opinion, okay? If you're president of the United States, y'all president, if he could tweet his opinion all day long, I could say mine. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> I wouldn't even finish saying nothing about him. <laughs> but since I brought his name up, y'all make sure y'all go vote. November, go vote. Get your friend, get their friend, tell a friend to tell a friend. Give them a ride. Don't make them give you no gas money if they ain't got it. Go vote. Because that man crazy. That man, that man crazy. I don't care if you voted for him or not, or if you like him, that's fine. But he's still crazy as hell. And ain't got good sense. Ain't got good sense. God gave him a mule. Now, what wrong with that man? He don't care about nobody. I don't just, and I ain't saying he prejudiced or nothing. I don't think he prejudiced. I think he just ain't got good sense. Because he don't care about nobody. Black, white, he don't care. He don't care. Only that man care about is that money. So y'all make sure y'all go vote. But anyway, I don't get on him. I don't even waste my time on the president.
my president is Barack. Mm -mm. My, I'm sorry. Let me put the title on there like I'm supposed to and show him that respect. President Barack Obama and First Lady Michelle Obama. That's my president. And not just because he's black. But back to the COVID. <clears throat> so, the school's here. Everybody going virtual. And when I talked to the lady this morning, not too long ago on the phone, she said, that's a good question. She said, you're the first person who called and asked that. And what I asked was, you know, do can I get some paperwork or something like that? Because I'm not going to sign the paper for her to get the laptop. And that's what she was talking about. So, my thing is this. When we was doing the survey, I thought the survey was for those parents who want their children to go to school. And those parents who wanted their children to be at home. Okay, so, you know, so that they can, like, divide it up or whatever. But, no, the survey was overall, so it's gonna, only going to pick one. So, that's why everybody virtual. But I think it would have made more sense to have the teachers that didn't mind going into the school. And I got I to gotta, I gotta go back because when I was there today, I think all the teachers were at the school in their classes, but they just ain't no kids in the school. They're just virtual. I'm thinking that's how it was today when I went this morning. But I think it would have made more sense if you could have had whichever parents that wanted their kids to go to school and the teachers that was willing to go, because like I say, they there now anyway. Put their mask on, make the kids wear the mask, and send those to the school. And then the other half that, you know, scared to send the kids, didn't want their kids to go, able to be at home with the kids, monitor their children, watch their kids, they could have let them be at home virtual. And then they could have also had the teachers that didn't want to go to the classroom and they could have been teaching virtual. I think it would have made more sense because now parents got to be to work at 6, 7, 8, 9, 10 o'clock in the morning and got three babies in elementary school. They got to be virtual. That's going to be a mess. Like, what are they going to do? Because the kids, the young kids got to be virtual as well. And if that parent or parents got to work, that, how they going to turn out? I don't think they thought this through. I really don't. I know the school is not a babysitter. Before some of y'all say that, I already know that. I'm not saying it is. But I'm saying it could have made it more convenient for those parents and the children learning. That's what I'm saying. Because it won't just be the parents be affected. It'll be the kids be affected by it too if they can't get their schoolwork done. Uh, and then that way you could have had, well, they could have had some of the children riding the bus. They could have skipped the seat. Only one, two, well, they ain't even have to skip a seat. They could have just put one to a seat instead of two or three. Because it probably would have worked out if they only had a few going to school and then the rest of them at home, you know? And then that way, the bus drivers could have been getting their full pay as well. The bus drivers who want to work, they would have been able to go out there and work. Also, the kids would have been able to ride the bus. Muskogee County, I'm pretty sure they could have got masks for every child in the school. And, um... If they ride the bus, they could have put them in the, um, these right here. I see a zip my bag. Come on here. I got my pretzels in here. My yoga pretzel. But look, zip my bag. That's all they had to do. And if they on the bus, give them the mask. They can put your name on the bag. You put your name on the zip my bag. Put Miss D right here. And when Miss D get ready to get off the bus, put the mask in here, and the bus driver get the bag. Leave it on the bus. That way, when Miss D come back to school the next morning, all right, y'all, get your bag and go to your seat. Put your mask on. 
Simple, because you already know some of the kids going to lose it, leave it at home, break it, tear it up. It's going to get dirty. You already know that. So, I just don't think they thought this whole thing through, y'all. I just don't think so. I just don't think so. Could have put a little more thought into this thing. Why y'all ain't tell her to call me? They should have called me. Shoot. Should have called me. Yeah, this thing got everybody messed up. I know that. I'm not saying that, but I just think they could have put a little more thought into it, you know, with these kids. And then I know they didn't put no thought into it, like, what child wasn't going to be able to get Chromebook. Because if they had them, there would have been something else in place for me to get today. So we're going to see what happened with that. I ain't going to get back on it, but we're going to wait and we're going to see patiently. I ain't going to throw no fit, no nothing. We're just going to wait. I hope it don't be too long because she's missing school. Yep. She is missing school. And like I said, today the first day. And I don't think today going to really count against none of the kids anyway because it was a lot of parents coming back to the school because they couldn't get on. They couldn't log on. The the laptop locked. They needed to unlock. It was just a lot going on with the, with the laptop stuff. So. Well, I know today nobody it's not gonna be counted against nobody. No. But I'm full though. I told you I can't eat that big old thing. That thing too big. Ooh, and it was delicious. Ooh, it was delicious. Delicious. <laughs> Y'all. Y'all know how them kids get silly and, and uh grouchy when they get sleepy? Yeah, that's me. I'm sleepy. All right, y'all. I ain't eating more, I can't. So, I'm going to have to holler at y'all in the next video, y'all. Stay prayed up. Keep your heads up out there. And y'all let me know. Let me know what y'all think. Y'all, y'all, because I just think they could just thought, put some more thought into that thing. I just don't, I don't know. I don't know. I just don't know. Probably me need to go to sleep and wake up again on the other side of the bed, maybe. Think so? Probably so. All right then, well that's what I'm finna go. I, I, I'm finna, I'm finna go to sleep, and I, I guess I'm, when I wake up, I'ma turn over and, and get out the bed on the other side and see if, see if I still think the same way. Okay, I do that. All right, <laughs> I'ma holler at y'all on the next video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Like I said, y'all go ahead and subscribe. It ain't gonna cost you nothing. Oh, y'all, let me tell y'all. So I got some new channels. Y'all make sure y'all go check out my new channel. Um, one of them is Cooking with Miss D, C-O-O-K-I-N-G-W-I-T-H-M-I-S-S, -S, and the letter D. So, Cooking with Miss D. My other channel is, um, y'all don't give me the line. It's, uh, Miss D. It's Miss D Vlogs. Y'all gotta make sure y'all visit that one. And, yeah, that's it. And I got an ASMR coming, but I, I don't have it up yet. So y'all make sure y'all, y'all, all my family, you know, y'all go check it out. Okay. And uh, make sure y'all subscribe to my channel. And I'm going to be hollering at y'all later. I guess I'll see y'all tomorrow, hopefully. I'm off tomorrow. So yeah, I'll see y'all tomorrow. All right, y'all have a good night and peace, love and blessings to you all. Keep God first and I'll talk to y'all later. Bye.